This is the process one to install the Marvel USB driver. If you haven't done so, please follow this video first to download the instructions and the driver. Okay, let's start the process. First, press and hold the shift key on the keyboard and click the restart button on the Windows Start menu. Now choose Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, Startup Settings, and then click the Restart button. We can see that number 7 is the option to disable driver signature enforcement. So press the 7 key to disable it. By the way, if you restart the computer later, it will be enabled again. This is kind of a Windows security feature. Okay, log in again and open the instructions. Ready for setup. We'll do this from the Cortana app on your phone or PC, so go grab that first. Then type Set Up My Invoke. As you can see, this Invoke device still has the Cortana software. Let's follow the steps to update it. First, connect the Invoke device to the laptop using a USB cable. Now follow the steps 6 and 7 exactly, that is press and hold the reset pinhole, power the device, then press the mic button 4 times quickly. However, I don't see the top panel displays the yellow light. Ok, let me show you another way to do it. First, open the device manager. The different step is that power up the device first. Next, press and hold the pinhole. Then press the mic button four times quickly. Now the device top panel displays the yellow light. Cool. Go back to the device manager. You can see a device with a name similar to BG2CD. Double click to open it. Update driver. Browse my computer for drivers. And then expand downloads the Harman Kardon folder. And then find the device driver. Next, now it's installing the driver, install it anyway. Good, it's done. And the computer recognized the invoke as a Marvel device. And this concludes the process one. You can find the video for the process two here when it is available. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next video.